Good morning, everybody. It's your girl, Kim. Welcome back to my car. I am ready to start my morning. It is officially 12.02, so we're going to kick off today. I already have my first order. It is Wendy's. It is $9.25, going 6.8 miles. It's an easy peasy order so I am on my way to Wendy's right now so guys if you are new to my channel you are gonna want to smash that subscribe button on the bottom I am trying to get to my thousand subscribers and I need everybody's help so help a girl out and get me to those thousand subscribers and smash that subscribe button also while you're down there give my video a big thumbs up and also leave me a comment I subscribed or any other comment I love interacting with everybody and I respond to each and every comment so guys I'm ready to kick off today so if you're ready I'm ready let's go make some money leave at door and then it says Terminator and I'm like I'm going to the Terminator's house I don't understand because it was a residential area to find out it was a house but it was also a pest control place as well so the pest control place was called the Terminator I'm like I'm going to the Terminator's house I don't understand anyway I have my next order store dash seven dollars three miles so that is my next order so I am on my way to Applebee's as we speak okay so order is done I'm declining chick-fil-a six dollars and fifty cents going 5.5 miles so I'm declining this if you're new to my channel chick-fil-a is one of those places I just don't do it is a hot mess around my area I know you guys some of you guys love chick-fil-a it is just not my cup of tea. And another Chick-fil-A, just in case the other one wasn't good enough, $6 going 5.4 more, 5.4 miles, I can't talk. Declining that as well. Can I get anything other than Chick-fil-A? I'm just saying, I swear, I get in like a five mile radius of Chick-fil-A and it's Chick-fil-A, Chick-fil-A, Chick-fil-A. And I'm like, I don't wanna go to Chick-fil-A. And another Chick-fil-A. $8.50 going 5.2 miles decline. I might have to put this on pause until I get out of this area because it's the only thing I'm getting is Chick-fil-A. The other order comes up with Chick-fil-A. I'm putting it on pause until I get closer to my area, which by the way, if you don't want to be in the area, you can always freaking check. I'm putting this on pause. You can always pause. So another Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A, 4.9 miles for $7. That is four in a row decline. Okay, so I'm going to put this on pause until I can get closer to my home. And then we'll see what other orders come in. <laughs> Guys, next order up, it is Panera and Wawa. It looks like it's actually... Maybe I'll zoom out a little bit. It looks like it's going to the same house, which is why I took the order. So it's $15.75. So I'm on my way right now to pick up the food. Hopefully 
hopefully it'll be a pretty easy order and we'll be on our way. So anyway, I'm on my way to Panera. drive so right before probably about a year before my daughter was born I bought a 2016 black Mustang and I love that car and when I had my daughter I had like this notion I don't know what I was thinking in my head I'm like I can make this work I can have a baby in a car seat in a Mustang and I was so sadly mistaken so I had to give up the Mustang for a family car it was just not working out with a baby in the back seat with a Mustang. So anyway, so if I could have a Mustang, I totally would have a Mustang again. It was a great car, I love that car. But the, my choices, there's a luxury choice and there is a practical choice. So my luxury choice is, is I've always been a BMW girl and if that's my dream car, I would love to get myself a BMW one day. My practical choice though, if if I well, I am gigging and I'm gonna continue to gig, I would want a either a Prius or an Iconic because the gas miles miles per gas on both of those cars are fantastic and it would make my life a little bit more easier. So anyway, that's my practical choice. So I'm just curious if you had a choice, whether it's practical, luxury, what would you want to drive in gigging? And if you are in your dream car, let me know what that is too. I'm just curious on what everybody's response will be. So anyway, just food for thought on a Monday. Just a fun topic to talk about. Okay, you guys, last order of the afternoon. It's a $12 order, only going two miles. So it is to Applebee's, which I guess, I don't know, it was Cosmic Wings, which I guess is now a part of Applebee's. I don't know, but it's Applebee's all the same. So I am about ready to pick up the order and then I will be calling it an afternoon. Okay, you guys, it is 2.13. I am officially calling it an afternoon. Good evening, I am back. It is 5.04. I already have my first order of the night. It is a batched order, $26.71, 6.6 miles, 40 minutes. So uh, good way to kick off tonight. So I'm just pulling up to the restaurant right now. Let me go in, grab it, and we are officially kicking off tonight. So. Let's go make that money. Dash, sorry, just went over train tracks. 
little bug me for a little while. So anyway, I'm literally a block away from the restaurant. It is a Greek grab-and-go type of place. They always have orders ready, which is why I always take orders from this place with a smile on my face. So anyway, I am pulling into the parking lot right now. Let me go grab it and let's go make that money. Okay, so I have the food. I'm on my way. It's a leave it at the door, but it says no contact delivery, please. You can leave it by the garage door. You can't see the house from the street, but the number is on the mailbox. Well, at least they made really detailed notes, so the they will have it dropped off by the garage door. kind of cute so I'm gonna complete the delivery hold on see they're different today they used to be bigger but now they're smaller I got nothing for you but hey it's an update <laughs> okay you guys here is my nine o'clock update so I'm at two hundred dollars which I'm super excited about because it's Monday I also have my next order which I think is pretty awesome too it is $15.20 going 6.6 .6 miles. It's a Burger King order, so an easy drive through order. So that's going to be my next order up. So anyway, let me go. Let me pick it up, and we're going to continue on. Okay, you guys, my fun times have come to an end. It's time to call it an evening. I will recap you guys a little later. Hey guys, I'm back. Let's go right into the numbers. So we'll start with DoorDash first. I did a total of $86.25 on DoorDash and I did 10 deliveries. So Uber, Uber, my winner of the day. 
$201.34. I did 14 trips on Uber. So if you can see the smile on my face, this is the reason why I did on a Monday $287.59. Whoo, what a Monday it was. So I did eight and a half hours yesterday. So my dollar per hour was $33.83 an hour. I did a total between both of them combined. Oops, sorry. I did 10 DoorDash deliveries. I did 14 Uber deliveries. So I did 24 deliveries altogether. So my average delivery yesterday was $11.95 per delivery. So guys, those are my totals. Thank you so much for watching this video until the end. I greatly appreciate it. If you are new to my channel, I do Uber Eats, I do DoorDash, and I multi-app between both of those apps. I teach you tips, I teach you tricks, and we learn from each other along the way. So don't forget to smash that subscribe button on the bottom. I am trying to get to my thousand subscribers and I need everybody's help in order to do so. So also I'm trying to get this video to 100 thumbs up. So don't forget to smash that thumbs up button on the bottom as well while you are down there. And then also don't forget to leave me a comment. I subscribed or any other comments. My favorite part of my day is interacting with all of you guys. So please make sure you guys leave me comments. That is all I have for you guys today. So if you're a driver, please stay safe and please stay healthy. Remember, kindness is always free. I will see you in the next ride along. Peace out.